all right. But the other heroes, I'm a little worried about their survivability. On the, on the flip side, though, Winter Wyvern's Winter's Curse is just really good. Draw, draw me, draw oh, yeah. her teammates can just... For our tour to at least draw even so far at CS, pretty close. Right now, this throw, not really going to get contested too much. The Doom is now going to make his way up here, but it's hard to open up on this, especially when you don't know where the Earthshaker is guaranteed in mid lane. Just like that, Old Chicken, he moves forward with the Fear type and the three-man game with the Sun Strike. He's going to be able to land, and Old Chicken tries to duke his way through the river, but it's not going to happen on tour. He gets the first blood. With his performance in general, because it just felt like he wasn't playing a part of the team, but this time, setting up for the first blood, making that rotation. I think it's safe to say it was probably one of the worst games that the Universe has ever played in his entire career, so yeah, being disappointed is... Putting it mildly, actually, so for for Secret to come out gun blazing in this one is is important. Also for him, I think having the debut debut on on, on this star started roster. The rotation to Secret so on point. The sun strike blows up the bat rider. The nature's call when it comes to dealing with supports, but it doesn't even look like they're focusing too much on the sling. Which oh, across the tour going to be ganked up by Ice 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 and Ben Rear. There's no way out for him here. Drops the sun strike at the last second, but it's not even close to landing in E-Home. They split ways. Ice 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 heading deeper into the jungle. It's actually going to get to a ward behind the tier 1 tower for potentially more dives in the future. I think part of that was set up too, just because the bottom lane was pushed in and the nature's probably oh, 11. Away. You had to be careful against the Drill Ranger! Those frost arrows! Not letting loose with that exorcism, and it may not be that Secret can get anything in return. With the exorcism already set up, I doubt they can rotate. Maybe they can get old Levin, though. Go for the tier one after that. Yeah, there it is. The fear build comes in once again. Universe displaying his globe movement from Team Secret. And on the way, too, they pick up the kill onto the Batrider. And it, you, you gotta ask yourself, is that a, a, a question of play by it? No, bottom, he's being stunned up. There's so much damage with this Zero Ranger. He gets the save for the Winter Wyvern, but it doesn't matter. The pure damage from the Sun Strike cuts right through. Wasn't actually helping him out, but now he's gonna come in. The tower is taken by the Dire, but a tour. Oh, he's actually gonna be able to get away. The Ice Wall plays right now. The turnaround. They've got the impale on the old 11. He can't go anywhere. He's so damn slow. And our tour. It's the bolt, the best world, and now Secret getting even more. Now Fender is going to go down as well. Secret! Yeah, so, the, the where did e -home go from here then, Jacob? I mean, right now they need to wait for the eyes of Sunny. They, they desperately need to blink back off on the bad rider so they can blink in. Bottom, don't tell me he's going to run into that sun strike. Still sprouted up. He has no way out. Time and time again, Secret outnumbering. But the angle for this even just feels a little bit off. I mean, the fact that Pilot Die is able to threaten the Death Prophet solo thanks to the global presence of the Sun Strike. They're actually going to be able to come in. Finger Death goes out. They do have to pull the Grace, though. No Puppy's thinking about running in, but he's going to be stopped in his tracks. Fenrir puts a stop to that one, but still, Artur is able to claim that kill. Now, the Ender goes out. He gets a bit of damage. Over to the Ender's going to top hold 11. Artur clips last hit and moves on the line. Another Sun comes through, and another kill for Secret. And even at the end, they're the one going down. And it's not just that, right? They have two towers down. The score is 12 to 2, and they're getting this 11 minute roll down. It's a complete demolishing. Oh. And every single time Lonham shows his face, pushes a little bit too far forward, trying to stop Secret. It can feel the combo of this magic damage. Now he's going to be stunned up. The Cold of Brace is only buying him a little bit of time. Puppy starts charging for it, but a really good silence is laid out from Old Chicken. But still, the Finger of Death cuts through the Bristle back once again and secretly to pick off a hero so that they can go high ground. But it looks like Ehome kind of understand what's going on here. Oh, the Fisher lands. The beautiful setup from Secret. Ooh. The combination of abilities just allows for. And to be able to kill Ice Ice. Universe picking up or going for a Aghanim Scepter on the Nature's Prophet. That combined with the Draw Aura is just gonna keep the Creep Waves constantly flowing into the. Then we are caught. To the Radiant I mean, it's, not, it's not even a question. It's not even a question at this point. Is Secret find a hero? There's really no hope for an escape from anybody for E Home. It's now Ice 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 gonna be the one spotted out. Fisher leads the way. The physical damage has no problem. They're playing such a control-heavy game at this point that e home aren't like just trying to run in secret and see, you know, what changes. You know, maybe, because at this point, we're just looking at this. They're being some the front door. I mean, they're just taking so much of the map right now that I don't think it matters. They're passively gaining a ton of gold at top. Look again, the combo. They can still get pick off. The Sun Strike is going to be enough. It is. Oh, man. Our torch is so far ahead in levels that that damage is too much. Highlight Die is going to be caught. That's the turnaround kill.
And you almost have to watch the game and he hasn't completed his first item with his uh, mechanism. Hold 11, scouts out some of these things, goes for the ticking eight bombs here to start pulling back Eternal Envy, but a three-man fisher, now the pull of two-man impale. Highline is gonna be doomed up, but everything goes set up for Poppy to come in for the Echo Slam. Rod is gonna be run down by Artur, the Viridor comes in, puts old 11 low enough that they can get that kill as well, and they're just planning to YP home, impossible. There it is, a buyback for the Wyvern, but you can't stop Secret. It'll land on a good old 3-2-2 for game number one between Secret and E-Home. That's some good old fan service by Evo, <laughs> letting you get to that point, calling it quits. First time I've seen two of the greater treats as well with that Nature Spock Ultimate, but dominant performance in game. Artizia actually topped plus 300 damage in that push. Gentlemen, what happened? I mean, this was game number one, but it was such a dominant game number one from Secret, who also, you know, actually got taken out in their first series. Did Secret step their game up? Oh, yeah, definitely. Still looking I'm, bad? What happened? They did step their game up, but 